under center to start things today. Oh, man. And hit immediately. Talk about getting hit. He's leveled by Kenny Bigelow. Play of the game. There's Bigelow, a busting assignment right away. You see Kennedy went the wrong way. The center seems to be going left. Bigelow goes to his left, and that is a... Boy, if you're a nose tackle, and Bigelow played at USC and did not play much. Struggled with knee surgeries. Played... Florida, Garantano in the shotgun. Has time trying to throw a slant that's broken up by Hakeem Bailey, intended for Marquez Calloway. See, he said, we just want to stay in sync with the chains, not fall behind third and longs. Here and comes the blitz. And on third and long, that's what the Mountaineers do is bring the heat. They brought everybody. And David Long brings up a fourth down. 45-yard yeah. line. And he comes running up on it at the 46. And immediately down there, but you talk about great field position for Will Greer and company. At the 48-yard line of Tennessee. Quick throw, quick completion, almost a quick first down. Gary Jennings with the catch. Throw down the middle on the run. It's his main man, David Sills. First down, Mountaineers. Had a pickup of about 25. Well, this is about as open as you can get. You know this is a passing team. They'll keep it on the ground this time. And a good run for Penaway. Almost broke away down to the 11-yard line. So this was a bit of a look of a play. Uh, he has full trust in him. From the nine, Will Greer loads, fires, end zone, Sims dropped it. It was into triple coverage, but he had his hands on it. He doesn't men let many of those get by him. No, that Third down at eight. Greer, plenty of time again. Moves to his left. Now he's in trouble. He's just going to have to air it to the corner. A prayer there and almost caught by Giovanni Haskins, the tight end. But it brings up fourth down, so it's a 26-yard field goal attempt. And up and in. So West Virginia was threatening. Looked like they were going to get a touchdown from their quarterback to their number one receiver. They have to settle for three here early. Tim Jordan in a tailback for the first time out for Tennessee. And he'll get the call, and he's going down, and it's Bigelow again. How about this kid? You talked about it. The transfer from USC didn't have a chance to play a lot. But that's not good. Third and eight here. Garantano loads, fires, got his man. First down. And it's Josh Palmer. Nice throw by Garantano. They'll move the chains. Sure was. I was out. Chandler flushes out of the backfield. Garantano again throws same spot as the last time. First down. And it's John Jennings still on his feet. Jennings all the way to the 42-yard line of West Virginia. He's a legend at Tennessee for a number of reasons, but some big catches in the past. And again, stuffing the run was Stills, Dante Stills, 14. Yeah, they've already converted two third and longs in this drive. Can they do it again? Here comes the blitz. Here comes everybody. Garantano, get rid of it. He did just in time, overthrew everybody and took a pretty big shot. And his helmet came flying off in the process. Well, if you talk about the people from Tennessee, what they love about Jared Garantano is his toughness. And by the way, this game here, this game site was part of it. That's right. They, they saw that several yes. years ago that they'd be playing here. Said, you can go home with us to play, <laughs> to start your season as a fifth-year senior, you know. Rear play action. Quick slant, complete. Sims has got it. And a first down. For the Mountaineers out across the 40-yard line. Station with Will Greer. First down. Again, play fake, plenty of time. Throws complete. T.J. Simmons down the sideline. Did he get there? Yes, he did. Touchdown. on this play goes out wide open zone very soft play for the Tennessee secondary breaks one tackle but the throw I've seen it before when you put them there they keep running Will Greer had 34 of these a year ago he's got 2018 off to a good start and a 
again. Trouble from the inside. This time's Reese Donahue. That front of the Mountaineers is playing lights out right now. Yeah, they're they're for the Tennessee offensive line. They were so excited about how they have been coming on, but right now they're just running through those tackles, blocks. No one really doing a good job. Ran right through it, and you know if you. For the Volunteers, they've got it back here. Garantano throws out in the flat. And a pickup of about seven for Chandler. We saw those first three possessions as we're welcoming you back inside the booth. And Gary, right now, Tennessee would love to have something end with a kick, not a punt, <laughs> an extra point or a field goal, something yeah. to get rolling here. <laughs> Eli Wolf, the tight end in motion. There's a little toss underhand. Sweet. It'll be short of the first down for Jordan. So trouble along the line, and their best guy's not in there. Tough run. I think he got the first down, though, Tim Jordan. You know, when you're a, a defensive lineman, the re The pitch to Tim Jordan, trying to get to the edge. Nice cut. He did. Yep. Almost got a first down. Nice run. Really was. Balls and eye backfield. Jordan, the second man through, going to try to cut it outside. But he got there. Picks up the first down. Ten years ago, I'd be happy. I just like coaching ball. I think he's making a little more money now than he was at Hoover, yeah. Alabama. He does. Really nice little play here. Jerk. Freshman All-American last year. Keep an eye on Dominic Wood Anderson. He's a special player in the tight end. Here's a throw and catch and trying to get to the first down is Marquez Calloway. Good for the Volunteers. Madre Landon in there first time. And he's got a first down. The Michigan State transfer picks up the first down for Tennessee. Garantano play fake. Fires left side. Completes it. Yep. And it's Marquez Calloway again. They only bring three again. Garantano throws complete to Palmer. And first get down. It. I don't get it. I don't know. You got a hot quarterback. You got a struggling offensive line. Jordan up the middle. Jordan heading to the end zone. Down to the one yard line. Marquez Calloway in motion. Garantano rolls that way. Now he's going to tuck it, and he's knocked down at the two. Kenny Robinson and David Long are there. Great call by West Virginia. Fourth and goal. Garantano play fake. End zone. Touchdown, Tennessee. Dominic Wood Anderson. Busted coverage by West Virginia. Jeremy Pruitt is right, and Gary Danielson is wrong. After getting rid of the football, here he is coming up fire to Callaway on the outside, and Marquez gets it out to the 36 as we check in with Jamie. Here's the guy that's the other one, Tim Jordan, down the sideline. Oh, boy, you love that. Hey, ball fans, you got to love this. That's the physical play that has been dialed up and what all of Tennessee fans are waiting for. Garantano under center. Here comes a end around to Palmer. And Palmer's got some room to work. Goes for about eight more before David Long can bring him down. Andre London this time. And he's going to get dropped for a loss. Ezekiel Rose drops him for a two-yard loss, maybe more. We're down at four. They're going to run it, and they're going to lose yardage again. So they wasted an opportunity with a couple of runs there. London lost yardage both times. David Long knocks his helmet off. Greer rolls, throws on the run, completes it back to Sills. Wide open, and so by first and five. Quick throw to the outside, complete. It's to Marcus Sims, and he's got a first down and out of bounds. The freshman, nice play. Second and ten. Greer looks right. Now draw play quickly to Brown, and Brown's got a first down. Letty Brown with an 11-yard run. At the 19, Greer backpedals in trouble, and he's going down. Tennessee finally got to him. Shy Tuttle, the nose tackle. Got four halftime here. Second and 12, Will Greer waits. Now flushed out of the pocket. He's in trouble. Look out, Will. Time is down under 10 seconds. 
And he runs down the sideline and almost runs out of time. I thought that was a peel back block against a defenseless player. I'm shocked that it wasn't called on the scramble that time. Up nears. Kick is up. And he tucked it inside the left uprights as the half comes to a close. Well, the goal for Jeremy Pruitt, as you look at Dana Holgerson leave the field with a 13-7 lead, was can I get it to the second half in a ball game? Goal accomplished. Certainly has. Trailing by six as he heads to his locker room before Dana Holgerson heads to his. You can. First down from the 32. Blitz coming. Screen out of the flat. Cut away. Didn't get away. Nice job hanging with it. Carter was a all-SEC performer at Tennessee and a number one draft choice in the NFL. There's a swing pass out to Petaway. Kyle Phillips brought him down. It'll bring up third down. Great hustle from Kyle Phillips that time. Just to his receiver on the left side. Looks that way, throws that way. Hot man, first down, and more. Marcus Sims into the secondary. Coordinator is doing now with his quarterback. Got it all the way to the 33-yard line. Play action. Nice blitz pick up. Long ball. Sills. Touchdown. This time, quarter blitz. Trayvon Flowers has got him. Instead of going with the hitch, going to run a little hitch route. Sills said, no, nope, I'm going for it. I get a flat-footed safety on the play, and this time, Greer does not miss the easy throw. Looks up with his main target from a year ago. David Sills, who had 18 of those last season. Will Greer, two touchdown passes in West Virginia, strikes early in the third. Second down at two. Gaetano out. Almost taking a knee with Cedric Tillman to make that catch. I don't think he did, though, but he's buried anyway. Tim Jordan's going to flare out of the backfield. Garantano down the middle hit his receiver but he's hit immediately and it's incomplete nice play by Toya Savory Draw play Petaway and breaks away across midfield and he's still dragging volunteers with him toughest run of the day by far Martel Petaway the second big play against the Tennessee dime defense it was a kind of inadvertent hit now the swing pass out in the flat to Sinkfield. Sinkfield follows his blockers, and he's close to a first down. Yep. First down. This Tennessee defense badly needs a stop. Remember, the game started out. Greer takes another shot. And this time he's down. Gary Jennings, touchdown. Oh, man. It wasn't three yards out of bounds. That was perfect. Yep. <laughs> Eating at halftime beats coaching at halftime. <laughs> Another look. Jennings on a perfect ball from the preseason first team All-American Will Greer. Mountaineers rolling here in the third. First down at the 25 for Tennessee. They need an answer. Well, maybe they've got something working right here. Tim Jordan all the way into Mountaineer territory. Best run of the day by Jordan. Ready. Jordan's got 91 yards on the ground. Now they go to Madre London. And London should have a first down at the 35. He's very close to it anyway. Jordan back in there. Play fake. Garantano fires in the flat complete. Jawan Jennings first down. Still battling over there on the sideline. Yep, he's that emotional leader. He could be. He's got to earn that spot. Garantano again. Play fake down the middle. Ball up in the air. Incomplete. Oh, Intended for Palmer. He's going to call interference on that play? Out with this left arm. Pass interference. Defense. Number three. Five foul. Automatic Ooh. first down. And it wasn't number three, it was number four. And, and I think it was Josh a pretty Norwood. good play, though. Well, you can't see from behind. Remember, from behind, the official is looking at that trailing right arm. And he must have hooked Josh Palmer on the play. And that's why he got called. Oh, there see you that go. arm right yep. there? That's why he got called. Good he field this time for Tennessee. 
Tim Jordan, the second man through. Jordan to the five, down close to the four. David Long made the stop. And Tim Jordan cuts it outside. He'll walk in. Touchdown, Tennessee. Play that drive finished with Tim Jordan and started with Tim Jordan. Remember that opening run to start the drive. Tim's got twice as many yards in this game as he had last year. Volunteers hanging in with the Mountaineers. And seven possible blitz coming off the corner here for Tennessee. They're bringing it. And Greer's throwing the other way. Oh, what a catch by Jennings. No, I, I know. I know it's what a catch. But that's like handing off a baton to a guy 35 yards downfield. <laughs> he needs to play from the pocket and stop trying to be all this running that he has to do. Just relax, throw the ball, be more Kurt Warner, you know, than... Uh, and take that six-yard play right yes, there. take the... Down the ground. Brown, first down run. Letty Brown, the true freshman. He said no. I gave him complete control of the offense. There's Brown again, another good run. Spavadol, who's been with some good quarterbacks along the way. Greer, blitz coming. Throws, complete first down. And that's Giovanni Haskins, the tight end. This is something they haven't had a lot of good tight ends. Now they got three or four of them. Back to the ground, and Lenny Brown. Five-yard run, a tough one by the kid. Eggfield. Greer throws it to him in the flat for the touchdown. One play, one touchdown. Hello, Kennedy. Well, I think he knew he had this touchdown before he snapped the ball. He's right. They like it, I guess. Two-point conversion incomplete. Intended for the tight end, Trevon Wesco. Let's see if they have another answer. They did the last time they had the ball. And it was this guy that got him the touchdown, Tim Jordan. And he's bounced in cartwheels across the first down marker. Very I would assume he would. Yeah. And here's Jordan again. Picked up about four more. David Long is still down after. Jeremy Banks, a freshman in the backfield. Play pick by Garantano. He's got his man, Marquez Calloway. Quick throw out of bounds. First down. You know? Tim Jordan's been the workhorse today. Trying to bounce it outside. He's going to lose a yard. All three receivers to the right for Garantano. Wants to throw a screen back the other way. And he overthrew the intended receiver. Down at 11. Greer from his own goal line. Down the middle, and he got it right on target to Jennings again. First down, West Virginia. Greer again. The quick out the other way, Dominique Maiden. That's a first down run by Kennedy McCoy with authority. Now you keep it away from the Kyler Murrays and guys like that when you're playing Oklahoma or you're playing TCU or Texas, whatever the case might be. Let's take a look at the schedule. Gary brought it up. Teams. I like that. Man. Ball's out. Here it is. Can you get the ball back? Tennessee says they have it. Here down and hurt too. It is Tennessee ball. Bet you if App State scores, they go for two. There's that play to the left Mark side. Quez, Callaway, and he's into West Virginia territory, down to the 43. They must have had five of those in this game. And point. They got 20 on that one though, down to the 43. Jared Garantano down the middle. Great strike again. What a throw. Yes, great anticipation. He threw that before the receiver actually crossed past the. Jeremy Banks in the ball backfield. Here they come. Here they come on the blitz. And the throw is complete. <laughs> and it's Jeremy Banks. This time, Jared knew he had. Goal just outside the four. Garantano fires. Goal line no. Only to the two. 
I thought on that crossing pattern that Josh Palmer was going to be closer to the goal line, but he's not, and it's fourth and goal. And another one here. Garantano, pressure coming. Lofts it, corner, too far for Palmer, incomplete. And second down and eight, under six minutes to go. Will Greer fires from his own end zone, and he's got Sills again. Yeah, he was out the box. David Sills. All the way out to the 42. I thought he was going to get tackled. That's why I started my commentary there. Now. You're just excited. I thought he was going to get tackled. It's going to be a judgment call because he did clearly go out of bounds. And he's still running. And right now they had the change set up at 42. Here's the throw out in the flat to Sinkfield. Sinkfield's got it out near midfield. Love for it, for granted. He had to come back to West Virginia with a different mindset. Dana Holgerson said he had to let that quarterback stuff go to become the wide receiver he is. And he's a good one. And so is this tight end who's going to be a big part of this pretty soon. 275-pound Trevon Wesco will wake up tomorrow and go, maybe he is a Heisman candidate. Here's a toss. Sims on the end around. On the stay in bounds, and he did, I think. Yes, he did. Dangerous guys. Marcus. Brown stays in there in the backfield to get the carry again. He's stuffed this time. Nice job. Daniel Batuli, he is always around the football. I mean, is his blood pressure or heartbeat ever go up at all? It doesn't yeah. look like it at all. Evan Staley from 32 yards wide left. I thought they were off sides. Yeah, maybe they were. Marquill Osborne, number three, I thought he was off sides coming around the corner. I think he even knew he was off sides. The third down. Greer, end zone, Sills, touchdown. Stat throw, stat throw, Heisman throw. Five touchdown throw. Yes. Number 17 team in the country, and they move, they're probably going to move up from that spot a little bit this week. I think so. I think so. 